say get to bed earlier and have a consistent bedtime. The performances are over. Now the question is, will it be Philip or Jessica? That'll be answered in tonight's American Idol finale. Fox's Anita Vogel live in L.A. with a look at what we can expect for tonight's star. The countdown has begun for the crowning of the next American Idol. The nation now waiting for the results. Do fans prefer Jessica or Philip? I can't run from myself. There's no way. Jessica Sanchez and Philip Phillips facing off in their very last battle. And darling, darling, stand by me. I think we both had a lot of strengths tonight. We didn't, it was nothing new or anything. It was all fun. I think we're both winners in the end. And um, tonight we didn't just sing for the judges, we sang for America. The 16 year old California girl and the 21 year old Georgia native, each performing three songs, including their potential single. As we roll down this unfamiliar road. Idol judge Steven Tyler saying it's a dead heat. I love her godlike voice and I particularly love the risks and the vulnerability that Philip Phillips exudes. Former American Idol winner Chris Allen says no matter who wins, the future is bright for both finalists. Whoever wins, they're, they're going to be great, and whoever doesn't win, it's going to be fine, too. So um, it, it's, it's really not about that. The winner will be announced tonight in grand fashion in a two-hour result show. We're told some of the biggest names in the industry will take the stage. We're hearing folks like Rihanna and Reba McIntyre. In Los Angeles, Anita Vogel, Fox News. Fox 6 is the only place you can watch the two-hour American Idol finale. It starts at 7 o'clock tonight. Well, this is certainly a new era in the comic book world. Marvel Comics' first openly gay hero will marry his longtime boyfriend in Astonishing X.